Greetings, everybody. My name is Sanya. That's I. I'm a deafblind person. I'm a president of Croatian Association of the Deafblind Persons. I'm very sorry that I couldn't be present today, especially because we're cooperating with the Deaf Blind Association one in Slovenia for a very long time, since 2005. And I remember very well how our cooperation has progressed and Deaf Blind people have got very better lives because of it. It was very problematic because the deaf blind weren't considered in many laws. But after a little less than 20 years, we can see a lot of improvements. And I'm so happy because things are getting better. Still, there's a lot of work that needs to be done. And I just want to emphasize a couple of important things. We always have to support our Slovenian colleagues, deafblind colleagues, because without the organization, deafblind people have no chances of working by themselves. We should never forget as well that we shouldn't leave deafblind persons behind. That's a motto that we use. One more important thing is that we shouldn't do anything about that blind without that blind. Those are things that can really help broaden and realize the situation of the deaf blind and organize the proper support. Another very important thing for the decision makers it's really important to have good communication with the organizations of the deaf blind because they know the good examples and examples of good practices so you can make better decisions and ameliorate their lives second also important thing is inclusion you should make happen for the deaf blind to get included. They're trying and lobbying for their rights, but they are not. They cannot do it properly if they don't have the proper support to do it. They should have their interpreters, and then they can be included in different levels of government, of politics, of travel. Deaf blind people can do that. But we need to make sure and ensure that they have the proper support. That was a summary of what I wanted to tell you. And I want to mention a very important document that was published by World Federation of the Deaf Blind. That's a document that's very important for the persons that are leading organization of the deaf blind. The name of the document is Deaf Blind People's Right to Decide for Themselves. Because there are a lot of issues and with this document they can be sold or lobby for solving. You can find it on the website of the World Federation of the Deaf Blind. And that can be used as a base or as a guide for uh, making deafblind people rights happen. Thank you for your attention.